Imagine a world where range anxiety doesn't exist. Imagine pulling into a charging station, plugging in your car, and before you can even finish scrolling through your Twitter feed, snap, you are fully charged. Five minutes, done. Now, imagine that same battery doesn't just last for a few years, imagine it lasts for a century. A battery that could literally outlive the car it drives, the driver who owns it, and maybe even the road it drives on. For decades, this has been the holy grail of energy. It's the stuff of science fiction, the kind of promise we hear every year, usually followed by the phrase, coming in five years. But what if I told you the wait is over? What if I told you that a company you might not have heard of, Donut Lab, claims they have cracked the code? They say they aren't just testing this technology, they are shipping it today in production vehicles. If they are telling the truth, the internal combustion engine is dead, lithium ion is dead, and the world changes overnight. But if they are lying, this might be the biggest tech scam of the 21st century. Welcome to Izan Tech. Today, we are not just reading the headlines, we are investigating the impossible. Let's dig in. Let's start with the numbers, because frankly, they are ridiculous. According to Donut Lab CEO Marco Liamaki, their new solid-state battery cell hits an energy density of 400 watt-hours per kilogram. To put that into perspective, the best Tesla batteries on the road today, they hover around 250 to 260. Donut Lab is claiming nearly double the energy density of the industry leader. But that's not even the crazy part. They claim this battery can fully charge 0 to 100% in 5 minutes, and they claim it can survive 100,000 charge cycles. 100,000 cycles? Do the math with me. If you charged your car every single day, that battery would last for 273 years. These numbers don't just challenge our current technology, they seem to insult the laws of physics. In battery engineering, we have something called the triangle of compromise. You can have high energy density, you can have fast charging, or you can have long life. You pick two, you never get all three. Donut Lab says, we took all three, and they claim they did it with an all-solid-state design, no flammable liquid electrolytes, no heavy cooling systems, and costs lower than lithium-ion. Naturally, the scientific community looked at these claims and said, impossible. The skepticism isn't just unwarranted doubt, it's based on a history of failure. We've seen giants like Toyota, Samsung, and QuantumScape pour billions into solid-state research only to be delayed by the same problems, dendrites. Dendrites are these tiny, needle-like lithium crystals that grow inside a solid battery when you charge it too fast. They pierce the separator, short-circuit the cell, and boom! dead battery. So when Donut Lab showed up at CES, Consumer Electronics Show, to unveil this miracle, everyone expected to see proof. They expected live demos, real-time data. Instead, they showed us empty boxes. That's right, empty battery casings. No chemistry inside, no live charging demo, just a cool-looking shell. For the skeptics, this was the smoking gun. It looked like vaporware. It looked like another startup trying to pump their stock price before vanishing into the night. If you look at the comments on their announcement video, it's a bloodbath. Fake. Scam. CGI. And honestly, I don't blame them. In an industry where verified data is king, showing up with an empty box is usually a death sentence. But here at Izan Tech, we don't just stop at the surface. We looked closer at those empty shells, and we found something interesting. Paradoxically, those empty casings might be the strongest proof that this is real. You see, scammers usually build flashy prototypes that look good on camera but make no sense mechanically. But these modules, they were fully industrialized. We saw standardized mounting points. We saw integrated thermal cooling channels designed for specific vehicle chassis. We saw heavy-duty structural reinforcement.
You don't spend millions of dollars tooling up a factory to build complex vehicle-ready casings if you don't have a battery cell to put inside them. You design the packaging after the science works, not before. The fact that Donut Lab has moved to the packaging phase suggests the chemistry is already done. They aren't trying to prove it works in a beaker anymore, they're trying to fit it into a bike. And that brings us to the ultimate proof, the Verge TS Pro. While other solid-state companies are trying to partner with massive car giants like Ford or Volkswagen, deals that take years of red tape, Donut Lab did something smarter. They went small. They partnered with Verge Motorcycles to put this battery in a high-end electric bike. Deliveries aren't planned for someday. They're planned for customers, not labs. This is a brilliant strategy. Think about it. A motorcycle battery is smaller. It's safer to manage. If it fails, it's easier to fix than a massive SUV pack. By targeting drones, scooters, and motorcycles first, Donut Lab is validating their tech in the real world while the competitors are still writing research papers. This aligns with how technology actually evolves. Lithium-ion didn't start in your Tesla. It started in your Sony camcorder. It started in your laptop. Donut Lab is respecting the process of scaling up. But what about those 100-year lifespan claims? How is that physically possible? There is a theory circulating among experts that Donut Lab might be using a hybrid architecture. Standard batteries rely on chemical reactions, which degrade over time, but supercapacitors store energy electrostatically, like static electricity. Capacitors can charge instantly and last virtually forever, but they can't hold much energy. If Donut Lab has found a way to merge the density of a battery with the durability of a capacitor, a solid-state hybrid, it would explain everything. It would explain the five-minute charge. It would explain the 100,000 cycles. It would explain why it doesn't overheat. They aren't breaking the laws of physics. They are rewriting the rulebook on how we categorize energy storage. It's not just a battery. It's something new. I want to take a moment to speak to you directly about what this represents. It is so easy to be a skeptic today. It is safe to sit in the comments section and type fake. It protects you from disappointment. But history, history doesn't remember the skeptics. History remembers the crazy ones. When the Wright brothers said they could fly, the experts provided mathematical proof that heavier-than-air flight was impossible. When the Internet was born, newspapers said it was a passing fad. Donut Lab might fail. They might crash and burn. But they're stepping into the arena. They are trying to solve the hardest problem in modern engineering. Innovation isn't about being right 100% of the time. It's about having the courage to look at the impossible and say, I can fix that. Whether this specific battery is the one that changes the world or not, the fact that they are pushing the boundary forces everyone else to run faster. That is how we move forward. That is the spirit of Izan Tech. So, here is the verdict. Is Donut Lab's battery a scam? I don't think so. I think it's a case of selective readiness. They likely have a working technology that is perfect for motorcycles and drones right now. Is it ready to power a semi-truck across the country? Probably not yet. But does it need to be? The revolution often starts quietly in niche markets before it takes over the world. We will be watching the Verge motorcycle launch very closely. The moment those bikes hit the road, the truth will be undeniable. Real-world data doesn't lie. Host, but I want to hear from you. Would you buy an electric motorcycle today if you knew the battery would last 100 years? Or do you need to see it to believe it? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this deep dive, do me a favor, hit that like button. It helps the algorithm find more people like us who are obsessed with the future. And if you want to stay ahead of the curve on the tech that is shaping our world, make sure you subscribe to Izan Tech and turn on notifications. We are tracking this story, and believe me, you don't want to miss the next update. Keep innovating, keep dreaming, and I'll see you in the next one.